Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ms. Roxanon. This is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Era. We're doing season four, episode 15, and it's called Taken. And I'm trying out a new mic, so hopefully it wants to work out today. So if it works, let me know. All right, so we start off with physical therapy time with Felicity with um, Curtis, um, Curtis's husband. I can't talk right already. Anyway, so um, it doesn't go too well, and because she keeps falling and she's getting very agitated because the implant should have worked, but it hasn't yet. Then we have the flashback where um, Oliver's prize is near, or Riker's prize is near. Then we have go back to the present day where Dark shows up and blackmails him uh, <laughs> about William. Then Oliver comes clean about William. And then Felicity is furious about it. Like, really furious about it. Then Oliver tells Team Arrow about William. And then uh, Samantha co confronts Oliver and then tells her she and tells her that he is the Green Arrow. Then uh, Samantha apologizes to Laurel because they used to be friends, but then Samantha not, got knocked up by Oliver while she was dating, while he was dating Laurel, so she feels really bad about that. But Laurel's kind of okay with it, but kind of not. And she says, "Not your fault. You, he was a player back then." So then, um, then we cut to Oliver gets Vixen to help. So this is the intro to Vixen and to. The main Arrowverse and not just the cartoon version or the anime version on the CW Seed. So, um, turns out Vixen can find him by basically sniffing something. Kind of, it's kind of weird. She has to sniff something of his to follow his scent. So we have a flashback scene where something weird is happening, but we don't really know what yet. And then we go back to the present day. Where uh, basically Malcolm visits Thea, then Malcolm lied to her, saying that he had nothing to do with William's kidnapping. Then we have, then we cut to Vixen is searching for William uh, using the scent, and she's like flying around trying to find stuff. And then we cut to where Samantha and Felicity talk, and it's not really a great talk either. <laughs> and then uh, Laurel and Wentz talk, and she's like, she's like, She's upset, but not in what you expect she'll be upset about. Like, she's well, it's understand why she's upset, obviously, but she's just like, I didn't set to be this upset about it just because it's been years and years since we've been together, and you know, but it still hurts. So, um, then finally, Vixen and team Eric found the location, so they, uh, but Dark moved on literally two minutes before they got there. So then it's Dart versus Oliver, and then Dart versus Vixen, and he actually notices the actual uh, toe that she's wearing around her neck, and that and says, "Ooh, I haven't seen that in a long time." But uh, Dart got away, and then Vixen loses the scent. Then Dart calls Oliver and tells him to drop out tonight, drop out of the race, and or wins. Um, and then. We have a flashback where Ghost Cochlin visits Oliver. Um, well, he doesn't visit him. He lets Oliver pass because um, at first he said no one can enter, but he looks at Oliver and says, you are worthy. You may pass. Then we go to the present day where Oliver withdraws uh, from the race. Then Oliver apologizes to Adam, which is the campaign guy, or Alex. Alex, not Adam. I don't know why I said Ab. Anyway. He says sorry about um, about what happened, but he had to do it. And then we have uh, Mari, which is Vixen's um, actual name, found something, and then she talks to Oliver and tells him to push William away because um, like even this little contact that they've been having, like his whole kidnapping and all this stuff, and he's just better off not knowing and to live. Uh, like a life, like a normal life until he's like ready to know about like when he's like 18 or something like that. And then uh, Dark calls and then he said he'll be at the plaza in three hours. 
but they are still going to go after Dart. They're still going to try to find what he needs um, to get him. So, uh, turns out Vixen actually took the podium. And so, uh, basically, also she explained how the totem works. It's basically like um, a wireless connection. Like, what's the strongest wireless connection to get your internet speed working? So, basically, she said that the powers work the same way. There's different hubs or different uh, Wi-Fi connector connectors that are stronger. And one of them happens to be in Central City, so they find it. So basically, um, Vixen finds where the strongest location is, goes there, finds Dark, and then steals the totem from him. Then um, Vixen is trying to break the totem. Um, and now that's, that's happening, Team Arrow is battling against Dark and just against the Gus and trying to get William. And right before Dark kill, uh, is about to kill everybody, she breaks the totem and he loses his powers. And then the police show up and get William, and then we have a flashback scene where they go to find the object, and they go to the present day where uh, Vixen and Oliver talk before she leaves, like, hey, if you ever need anything, please don't feel free to call me. I'll be there as soon as I can. And the same goes for me. Like, if you need help, you know, they're basically being a, having a camaraderie for each other, and it's like, hey, if you need help in any other cities, we'll be there to help each other out. Basically, and then uh, then Thea goes off on Malcolm because she found out that he lied to her, and then about William and how how he stole William and took it to dark. Then Oliver makes a video for William to uh, let him know why they why how the events happened and why they happened. And let us know that he has a green arrow, and he's very sorry, and uh, he hopes he understands in a few years. And then uh, Felicity walks in with that, and she literally blows up at him when he finishes the video. And basically what happens is they break up, because, I mean, I don't understand why they even really broke up, to be honest, but I'll say that for the end. <laughs> I'll say that for the end, I gotta compartmentalize this. Carm compartmentalization it whatever gotta save her later anyway so they break off the engagement and then she literally starts to walk so the implant literally starts to work and she literally walks out on him and that's the end of the episode and that was a dirty messed up little episode right there um I mean just cause like all the twists and turns and stuff I'm just I don't know how to really take it I will probably give this a B plus just because, like, um, I just feel like they Felicity broke up with all for, like, a really stupid reason. Because I do ship publicity, but I do understand why she's mad. But I don't think she would be that mad. I don't think the character we see in character, um, in seasons one through three would be that mad at him for that. So, um, because, like, the mom, like, it's, like, his, is his kid. So, if the mom says, like, you can't tell anybody... Or you'll never see him again. Of course you're going to choose your kid over your girlfriend slash fiance or wife. I mean, just I mean that's how I would do it. I would do the same thing that he did because it's your kid. But um, I just feel like she. I feel like she could have been more understanding about it. And I think it was just like a kind of crap way just in a relationship, just because he kept that one thing from her. But he's been pretty much upfront about everything else. Anyway, that's how I feel about it. I'm going to stop it here because then it'll turn into a 30-minute conversation and I don't have time for that. So anyway, um, if you like this video, please go to like. Let me know how my mic did. I think it's doing pretty decent. Uh, but I, there's a higher quality mic that I do want to get. But I found this app that could change my current mic and make it sound better. But only for speaking. I can't do anything for the whole music thing. I have to get a better mic for that so that it actually will work right. So anyway, um, if you like this, like I said, please let me know down below what you think. And then um, what you think of the episode. Do you agree or disagree? And this is a long one. So uh, subscribe and then I'll see you on my next video. And, you know, I really would appreciate some feedback on the mic and how everything's going so far. So anyway, 
Have a great day. I'll see you on my next video. Bye, everybody.